Hello and welcome to SD Speechless. Today's video is going to be another pickaxe combo video and today's pickaxe will be Peppermint Parasol. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be another pickaxe combo video and today's pickaxe could be the Peppermint Parasol which is Jack Skeleton's pickaxe and you can still pick it up in the item shop under the Jack Skeleton tab. You can even get it in the Jack Skeleton bundle or if you want to buy it yourself you can just buy the Peppermint Parasol by itself. And as you see the colour scheme is a nice green, red and white with a nice, nice candy cane handle. It's pretty easy to combo with and it's a part of the Pumpkin King set in season chapter 4, season 4 and has the description don't crack your teeth and I sort of decided to make 10 combos like I usually do and the first skin is Nogops which is introduced all the way back in chapter 1 season 1 and was the one of the first ever Christmas skins I ever bought just such a good skin and works very nicely with the peppermint parasol because of the red and the green the back bling for this combo is the elf shield which is part of the polar legends set introduced in chapter 2 season 1 the polar legends polar legends set is the pack where you have to buy a pack to get the skins in the Polar Legends, so it's a Polar Legends pack you have to buy with actual money, not V-Bucks. And you got like three skins with it, it's quite a good pack and this pack really works perfectly for this combo. And the edit style I'm using is the default, mainly for the red, white, the candy cane and also the green on the shield itself. Pickaxe is a peppermint parasol. The glider is the Har Har Har, which is part of the Winterfest 20. 22 set in season chapter 4 season 1 so there's a reward from the Winterfest 2022 the contrail also was from Winterfest 2022 which is a ribbon trail but you can use any contrail that's green red or white themed ideally a Christmas one would work nicely but you can choose any of those colours I mentioned and then the wrap is well wrapped which is introduced in chapter 2 season 1 works very nicely for the red white and green let's move on to the next pavement house I'll pick out combos I decided to use a Yuletide Ranger Introduced in chapter one, season one. Also, I'm pretty sure this is um part of the same, would be part of the same set if they had a set of the way wearing the same costumes, but basically the Nogops and the Yulta. So this is pretty much the female, the male version of the Nogop skin, but the same design. Either way, they're both amazing skins. Back bling for this combo is the Shield Surprise, which is introduced in chapter two, season five, using it for the green and the red. And the wrap is a festive paper, which is introduced in chapter one, season seven. I'm pretty sure this is an item shop wrap, like a Christmas one that comes around around that time. Works very nicely for the green and the white. Let's move on to the next combo. This one, I thought I'd switch up and not use a Christmas skin for this combo. I'm using the Reflex, which is part of the Counter Attack set. Introduced in Chapter 1 and Season 6, mainly using it for the green. Back bling is a Rainbow Clover, part of the Green Clover set. Introduced in Chapter 1 and Season 8. As you can see on the Reflex skin itself, has green, has white, has, a, has two different types of green. Has light green, darker green, has black and white as well. And the wrap for this combo is ones and zeros, which is part of the Follow the White Rabbit set in season chapter three, season one, using it mainly for the green, but the black does work nicely with the reflex skin as well. Let's move on to the next skin, which is Glitch, which is part of the machine learning set in season chapter three, season four. You can either use Glitch or you can use Aaron. They're both part of the same set, both work nicely, depending if you want to use them. The female like robot or the male robot, it's totally up to you. The primary colour for this is red, but you can also use white. Would both work nice, but I decided to go with the red. The metal colour is blue still. So I was, if there was a whiter or redder one, I was planning to use the rose gold, but it just doesn't look right. So I decided to stick with blue still. The wrap is candy cane. Back bling is the bitter sweets, which is part of the gingerbread brigade set in season chapter two, season five. Many using it for the candy cane on the back of the back bling, the red and the white. And, and to be fair, the gingerbread face does look pretty cool as well. It works nicely with the colour scheme. The wrap is Candy Cane, which is an item shop wrap in season chapter one. Season seven comes around, uh, comes back out around the Christmas time, it's Christmas period. It works very nicely for the red and the white and the Candy Cane, obviously on the handle of the pickaxe itself and on the back bling as well. Let's move on to the next combo. This one, I thought I'd use Sergeant Winter, which is part of the chapter one, season seven battle pass, part of the Sergeant Winter set. And I'm using the headgear goggles. We can also use the battle bus. Balloon would both work nicely. Back bling is the Cherry Chime, which is part of the Polar Legend set in Season Chapter 2, Season 5. And I'm using the colour default for the red and the green. The gold belt is pretty cool as well. And the wrap I'm using is Falling Snow, which is part of the Winter, one Winter Wonderland set in Chapter 2, Season 1. Using it for the snowy theme. Goes very nicely with the white colour of the Sergeant Winner's hair and his beard. Let's move on to the next combo. I decided to use the Lieutenant Evergreen, which is part of the Piney Fresh 
set in just in chapter two season one and in chapter two season one you had a winter one land where you could basically open present and you got given the skin which is pretty cool you basically clicked on the tree and you got given him as a skin which is pretty cool so i decided to use him so it goes perfectly with the peppermint pick as you can see here with the color scheme back bling is a combat reef which is part or we don't have a set but was introduced in chapter one season seven using it mainly for the green and the red which works very nicely with obviously the tree itself of the skin and the wrap i'm using is twink is um Twinkly, which is part of the Winterfest 21 set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 1, using it for the red, green, and like the flashing lights on it. So, on a Christmas tree, you put lights on it, so it works perfectly with this skin. Let's move on to the next combo, which is probably my favorite combo for this pickaxe, which is a Chrysabelle, which is part of the Oak, Oak Witch Academy set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 1. And there was two versions of her. There's this one, is also a the um, like snowy version. Pretty sure this one was you had to claim it on. The Epic Games launch, or it may have been the other one actually. I think it may have been the Winter Fun one. I'm pretty sure this was a free one you could get in Chapter 3, Season 1, when like the Winter the winter event. I don't know if it was Winter Fest um, or the Winter One Land. I can't, can never remember which one's which, but I know one of the two was basically um, a free one that had to be claimed in the Epic Games. I'm pretty sure this was a free one, and the actual snowy one was the. Actually, I'll have a look. I, I always forget which one's which. So this one right here. So this one here, I'm pretty sure you had to get from claiming it on the Epic Games launcher. And this one was free as a reward. But either way, if you have this skin, it works nicely for the colour scheme. The red, the white, and the green are also on their dress for the trees, which is pretty cool. Back bling is the Banner Shield, part of the Banner Brigade set. You can either use the Banner Shield or the Banner Cape. Both would work nicely. And if you, for the Banner, I decided to use the Banner here because it has a snowflake and like a bow. But you can use any Christmas themed banners would work perfectly. Or choose any banner in general, but ideally you probably want to use a Christmas one. But anyone work nicely. I decided to just use red on the top row. But you can also use this red here. Both work nice. But I decided to do this one. Stuff like this one works better. And then the wrap is red line. Which is chapter one, season nine. Use it for the red and the white. Let's move on to the next combo. This one, I thought I'd use the Trail Blazer, which is part of the Advanced Forces set. Introducing chapter one, season four. And this skin is part of, part of one of the two Twitch Prime packs. Can never remember if it's the first one or the second one. But if you've got both of them, definitely have their skin mainly using this for the green and the white back bling is slashed which is in season chapter one season five and this back bling was a part of the back bling bundle you can get or backpack bundle you got this one the vintage and another one i can never remember what the last one is but you've got three in a pack in the store i think for like five six hundred v bucks i decided to pick it up all the way back in the day so it works very nicely for the color scheme and the wrap is dogfight which is part of the air royale set in season chapter one season eight mainly using it for the green I guess a black as well. Let's move on to the second last peppermint pickaxe combos. Peppermint power star pickaxe combos. I decided to use the Phantasm, which is part of the Elemental Eidolon set in season chapter 3, season 1. And this skin is a part of the Phantasm level up quest pack from that season. So if you pick that quest pack up and got all the 28 levels, you'd have all the rewards you need, or all the rewards for the quest pack. The star I'm using is Phantasm. But you can also use the hat off. You can even use the cyborg, totally up to you, but I decided to stick with the phantasm with the hat on. You can have it off. Back bling is the zero, which is Jack Skeleton's back bling, part of the Pumpkin King set. Introduced in chapter four, season four, mainly using it for the white and the red. And the wrap is the Glico Holiday, part of the Taste of the Paradise set. Introduced in chapter four, season three, so Battle Pass. And this was um, Paradise Meow Schools. Is weapon wrap from that season, mainly use it for the green, white, and the red. It's pretty cool looking weapon wrap. I can't say I've really ever used it, but works nicely for this combo. Let's move on to the final peppermint power cell pickaxe combos. I decided to use the Jolly Jammer, but you can use any of the skins which are part of the Cozy Commander's Cozy Command set. All would work nicely. The star I'm using is default. You can either use default or you could get away with using camo and maybe even pattern. But what I decided to go for default. Back bling is the hollow back. Part of the Bounders set in season chapter two, season four, and this is one of the two customizing super skins back blings. And I'm using the sticker bundle up, based like a Christmas jumper or Christmas sweater. As you see on the actual back bling, it has red, has white, has green on the sticker. So use anything Christmas theme, or if you don't have anything Christmas theme, just use anything red, white, or green theme would work nicely. And the weapon wrap is Slushy Sneak, which is from the Winterfest 2020 set, especially last season's Christmas event. Institution chapter 4, season 1, using it for the white and the red. So that's all the peppermint power style pickaxe combos done. I thought I'd get it done for Jack Skeleton Skin's pickaxe. I really do like this pickaxe a lot. I haven't used it as much since the Slasher pickaxe came out, which was Michael Myers. I have been using that a lot. But it is a pretty cool pickaxe. If you do have any other Fortnite related visuals, it could be cosmetic, for example, could be skin, backbling pickaxe, Grada, Slash Umbrella, Contra, or Weapon Ramp. Feel free to let me know. Or could be anything Fortnite related. I'm always down to give something else a go. 
But anyways, that was pretty decent.